Chad and JT, our boys. Were they back? Well, yeah, they were there. They they, were, they went to a uh, well. The title of the video is a peace treaty between skaters and city officials. So let's check it out. Into uh, public comments on non-agenda items. Uh, what up, Council? My name is Chad Kroger. <laughs> First off, wow, this pandemic is still pretty crazy, huh? Pandemic. I mean, seriously, what is going on? Anyways, you guys look good. Tans are popping. Nice. Yeah, so back when Chris first struck and got Tom Hanks, things were tough. But things got even tougher when the city committed what can only be described as an act of war against the youth. And I think you know what I'm talking about. You guys dumped sand in the skate park. It hurt. Oh, yeah, Almost we talked about this. Almost as bad as when this. Mia Selinski dumped sand in my heart in ninth grade when she decided to go to Europe for two weeks. And I'm all for safety, but this is a bit rash. And let me be clear, I'm cool not shredding Crete during lockdown. I'm cool not working. I don't even have a job. But I am not cool <laughs> with sand in the skate parks. We, we don't have a skate Skaters park. have been bullied for centuries. It's unfair. Can you imagine the city dumping sand on the tennis courts at Pelican Hill? These no. guys are just such dicks. Skaters don't even have an emoji. I mean, you got one for surfers, salsa dancers, even skiers. And thankfully, the skate park's open again, and we are psyched. But I can still hear like the sound shirt. of sand crunching in my bearings. Skateboarders need... This is a bit, some new people. Of course, these guys do this all the time. Oh, yeah, they go to Cincinnati City do. Council meetings and fuck with people. I still think my hands down my favorite uh, moment of these guys ever was shooting down Laura Loomer. Oh, yeah, that was, was great. I, I just like, hey, why don't you guys come over here? Why? <laughs> and they just Some went. people really think these guys are for real. I think that's hilarious. No. Restitution from the city. Restitution. So that we can all our way out of this conundrum. And there's no better person to propose this olive branch than my dog, JT. Oh, JT, yeah. here it comes. All right, go ahead. What up, council? I don't have an actual olive branch. That was a metaphor for peace. I'm a rollerblader. It's rare to see a blader and skater united for the same cause, but Chad and I learned long ago that we are stronger together. I want to push beyond the sand episode and get to a place where city officials and riders feel like they can coexist at Wahoos once again. In ancient times, a general after gaining dominion would do a ritual dance with his enemy. We need a gesture like that from the city that lets us know you hear Hang us. Hang on on that. I, it's worth just noting that we do not have a skate park. We did not dump any sand. <laughs> it's not even the right town. The, they're, they're in the wrong town. It's not even the right town. They're, they're in the wrong town. <laughs> Picture that has been shown is a different city. <coughs> so anyway, all right. We'll go to the next. Uh, we'll oh, the I next don't like. Now. Okay, look, dude. Look, wait, wait, uh, wait. Look, I get married. I, I, it's the wrong city. Does the, but does this guy not understand? I mean, obviously he doesn't, but this guy should understand, right, that, like, obviously there's some kind of playful trolling going on. This is obviously some kind Why do you got to be such a prick? Like, why do you got to be so, you know, like, I understand you're wasting time, whatever, but, like, this guy's being very, this is the kind of thing that can ruin a small level politician's yeah. career because it's like wouldn't you just kind of laugh it off just in case cameras are why you go all right guys look I, I get what you're doing but it's not you're not even the right town boys you're not, you're not even in the right town. we still think that you can serve as an ambassador for the rider and city official community that is why we are asking you mr mayor to drop into the san clemente skate park bowl it would be a huge message to riders all over that we can trust you don't be afraid. Just dip your shoulder. Commit to the drop like you commit to civil service. Ride it out. It'll be over in a few seconds. If you brick it, we'll have the same medical team there from the Jake Brown accident. And there is no more symbolic date for this to happen than September 4th, 2020. The day Tony Hawk Pro Skater 1 and 2 comes out on multiple Smart. platforms. Smart. This speech was paid for by Activision. Thank you. <laughs> okay, that's pretty great. That's pretty awesome. All right, thank you. <laughs> Skate or die. There you go. All right, so uh, any other public comments in the... And that's how it, uh, <clears throat> how it ended. That's fucking amazing. Skate or die, folks. I love the... I, I like these guys, man. 
what they do is very pure. There's not a lot of that left, you know what I mean? There's not a lot of just pure, like, I, I'm just here and I'm just being stupid. And I'm not, there's no agenda. I'm not here to fucking scream at anybody. I'm not, there. you know what I like about them? They're not trying to fucking own anybody. Mm. They're not trying to win at anything. You know what I mean? They're just showing up and they're just getting their dumb footage and they leave. They were in the wrong city, which <laughs> made it even better. And it, you know, it did take this guy a while. Someone had to walk up to him and go, hey, that's not the right city that they're talking about. I wonder, honestly, if that was even a bit. Like, I, I wonder if they honestly just went to the wrong place. <laughs> 